Is this nostalgic yet? Hello, and once again, good evening, YouTube. Welcome back. Welcome back to the Comic Cons Games channel, and welcome to copyrighted music. Very loud copyrighted music, for that matter. When did this game come out? I don't even know. What game, what year was this game for? It was for 2018. Okay, very good. Uh, hello, and once again, yeah, I already said that. Um, so, I have been wanting to do this for a while, and I actually did do this at one point, and then gave up because I was bored. Let's see how far we get into it this time. So, as you can see, this is NASCAR Heat 3. Like I said, is this nostalgic yet? Do, do people play this, like, you know, when, like, it was, like, 2014, and, like, like, NASCAR 07 was just released, like, seven years ago? Oh, it has been, it is not, there is no way it's been seven years since this came out. It's been six years since this came out, but that's still, well, actually, no, it was, like, late, late in the year when this, this was, like, an August release, right? So it's closer to five than it is six, but the numbers, the numbers don't lie, folks. The numbers don't lie. Today, we're going to be doing a championship mode because I think that would be fun. And thanks to What If Racing, shout out, major shout out to What If Racing for making uh, season mode cool again. Even though my Jeff Green season in NASCAR Thunder 2004 was like one of my best performing series on this channel. But it's okay. We're going to do a truck series season. Can you believe that? Um, oh, there you can only do the chase. You can do 12 tracks, 6 track. Oh, look at this. Oh, this is an interesting menu. Look at this. Oh, my goodness gracious. Wow. Okay, that's neat. I mean, I'd never do anything besides full season, but, like, you know. And you can view the schedule with the square button. This 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 menu is way less cool than the last one. But you know what I'm trying to say. Um, full season in the truck series. Wonder who I'm going to play as. <laughs> game, like, loads up and it's like, oh, it's Kamikaze Games. I'll put back with his bullshit again. Yeah, I wonder who I'm going to play as. I am still incredibly mad that he was not included in NASCAR Heat 5. Because I'm not kidding when I say that that's one of my proudest achievements. Not as, not as good as getting Griff Dog's brother onto Brett Moffat's truck, but close. Close. I do have this as a die cast, though. I will say that much. So, you know, that's, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Anyway, we're going to do this. Championship mode. All right. Here we go indeed. Uh, what settings are we going to use? It looks like we're on max difficulty, 13 length races, 2x nor the 2x the two that shit. This is just the settings that I had the, whatever I was doing last time I played this. So, you know. Anyway, um yeah. No damage. Interesting. Um maybe do we want damage? Maybe we want full damage? I would like to save the changes, I guess. Anyway, let's go to the first race of the season. First race of every season is always at Daytona, so this is going to be the most viewed episode where absolutely nothing happens, and it's going to taper off as the season goes on, and as we get deeper into the season with more interesting tracks where we have a much better chance of exciting races, those, those videos will have, like, a third of the views of this video in which we will just go fast in a straight line and turn occasionally in the truck series. This is not a commentary at all. This is not a social com I am- I should not be playing games. I am in no mood to be playing games right now. I had to convince myself to start playing this, by the way. Like, I was- I haven't recorded anything in a while, so like, I need to do something. Alright, so we've got practice. Something tells me we don't need that. Something tells me it's Daytona. Okay. Probably a waste of time to qualify, but I will do it regardless. What button is accelerate? All right, well, that's reverse. We have found the reverse button. Very good. All right. Very cool. Okay, we are making it happen. We are in manual gears. Okay, I gotta remember we're in manual gears. Yeah, this was the game that we did the first season of Core, right? Yeah, I think this entire playthrough was just going to be, is it okay to be nostalgic about 2018 yet? Because in spite of it being the worst year of my life, it was okay until, like, the day after 
the Truck Series race at Daytona. Because Corbin ran great. I was fucking thrilled. He led laps. That was amazing. But, like, I was real fucking happy um, with his run. And, like, it looked like, okay, okay, you know, this could be a good season. That was a fucking mistake to think that. And then, like, the next morning, I got a fucking strike on my channel for some of the Sonic porn games. And it was exactly one Sonic porn game video. It wasn't even some. It was one single video. And... That meant that I could not stream for three months. And, like, I had had so much fun doing the stream for the truck race at Daytona. I was thinking, damn, dude, I might stream the entire season. And then, immediately, my streaming abilities were taken away. Yeah. That's, uh, not fun. Not fun is the word I would go with. And then everything just kind of started going to shit at that point. And then, was that, was it before or after that that my memory card died? Was it before or after that race? It really set the stage. Those two moments really set the stage for the absolute fuckery that was going to be 2018. Anyway, I don't know how much of that I'm going to keep in. Maybe I should have saved that for the actual race. We qualified 25th. That works. It's not last. Very cool. Max McLaughlin is in this game. Who's on the pole? Hunter Nemechek. Okay. And Austin Wayne self second. That's interesting. Alright, we've got ourselves a race. I don't know what... Oh, boy. Um, we want recommended setup as stable as possible. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go not as stable as possible. <laughs> I'm gonna do a setup too. That's what I'm gonna do. Anyway... It is Daytona time. Let's do fast driving things. Timothy Peters is in the 92. That's gross. Dalton Sargent. Oh, he crashed during qualifying. Yeah, that's a Dalton Sargent moment if I've ever seen one. Oh, I remember that. Oh, good lord. Well, here we go. Hey, there's no mirror. What button is the mirror? I feel like that's important at this track. Uh-oh. Um, it's not square. Square is all. Oh, square is downshift. What? I don't know if is X is is X E break? No, that's change data up there. X and circle is changing data up there. Do we know what button is? Oh boy, do we know what button is rear view mirror? Because I feel like that is pretty important. It's not clicking the the stick. Oh boy, it's not clicking the other stick. That's the share button. Oh, fuck. There it is. Okay, found it. All right. Beautiful. Okay, pack racing at Daytona in 2018. Let's go. We're, re we're rewriting history. This is the official new timeline. We're going to try and piece together what the timeline would look like if this is how the 2018 truck season went. Let's go. All right, I'm stuck on the outside, which is terrifying. I know that there's the pause button, uh, the pause button glitch can get you, ooh, 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 okay. Oh boy, all I want to do, ooh, 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 is not be three wide middle. Please let me not be three wide middle, we're wrecking, oh god, we're wrecking, big time wrecking, oh, 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 we're in the air, oh, we're up and down, no, Garvin, no, oh my god, oh no, he's always oh, in terrible shape. How is there not a caution? Hello? Motherfucker, where's the caution? How are we not? Oh my goodness, we're back here. We're back here with fucking Chris Fontaine. Oh shit, well. Pain. Okay, looks like we're finishing stage one in last, as it turns out. Very sad day indeed. I tried. Nemechek gets that. Okay, so I think we're gonna do uh, full repairs. Um, I don't know what I want to do as far as everything else. Uh, uh, maybe more tape. I'm gonna put on more tape, and we'll hope for the best. Okay, we got a fresh truck. Last to first challenge. All right. Last to first challenge. Can I just say I have not played a heat game? In a long time. I do believe the last time that I played a heat game was when. Core was racing on it, so yeah. So something tells me that's uh 
That's probably how most of these races are going to go. Okay. All right. So we're back to the middle. We're back to the middle, unfortunately. I would like to be anywhere other than the middle. The yellow line is going to be my best friend. New best friend. Friendship ended with middle lane. Yellow line is new best friend. Okay. So we pit. So I forgot. Ah, oh, fucking son of a bitch. Okay, well. I forgot what button does what again. I I'm trying to figure out. Yeah, here's the button I'm looking for. Okay, so estimated fuel is 21 laps. Can we make it to the end of this race without pitting again? I'm going to say probably not, but the good news is that when we do pit, I can take like a half can of fuel and maybe gain a single spot on the on the track. So it looks like we will not be gaining stage points at Daytona. Right, let's go. One right side to that. Very unfortunate. Nice driving, that stage driver. Nice driving, yes. Yes, indeed. The crew chief, Doug George. Doug George is just condescending my ass. Oh no, there are no pit stops in this race because, uh-oh, everyone can make it on fuel. Alright, well, maybe we should have turned up uh, tire and fuel usage for this track. Whoops, alright, well, I guess we're, okay, so I guess we have to make up all this track time on our own. We need to find a way to make up 31 spots in seven laps. Very good. Or actually eight laps. Okay, let's get around Mike Harmon. Very good. Ooh, here we go. All right, beautiful. Don't fucking do it, bitch. Okay. Okay, we are making up spots. We're doing a good job. Okay. Is there a rival system in this game? I can't even remember. Okay, we got Tanner Thorson. Chili Bowl winner Tanner Thorson up here. Okay, here we go. Robbie Lyons is in this game. Man, there's all sorts of characters. There's all sorts of crazy characters in this, uh, in this experience of a game. It doesn't look like there's drafting partners yet, though. It's gonna be interesting to see, like, what evolved over the course of the, uh, 704, uh, line of games. So, like, if I need to, I could always do this. It didn't look like it actually made any difference, though. Alright, we may have to break some rules in order to get past these guys, because, wow. I mean, I know this is max difficulty, but I don't remember this being this difficult. I remember this game being, like, somewhat difficult. Like, probably the most difficult game that, you know, had come out of the Heat era. Like, actually, like, not like, you know, Heat Evolution level difficult, where it's just a shit game. I mean, like, you know, AI is, like, actually talented, kind of difficult. Boy, we are not making up positions. Has to be said. Please make passes. Didn't I win the fucking Daytona race in the Heat 2 version of this playthrough? Like, what the fuck is this? Oh my goodness, ladies and gentlemen in the audience, we are almost going to make a pass. We almost made a pass for, for fucking 27. There's not a lot of yet natural yellows in these games either. Because even when there is a wreck, half the time they don't throw the caution. Okay, can we... Yes, okay, okay, now we're doing it. Oh, now we're playing the game. Oh, now we're playing the feud. Can I have room? No, no room? Alright, well, so much for playing the feud. If anything, I'm going to lose a spot for that. I'm guessing there's been no changes for position up front either. Nemechek won both stages. That's 20 bonus points. So he's gonna... He's gonna be fucking gone in standings. We're gonna be not gone in standings. But the good news is, is that we only need to win once and we're in the chase. Now, as for the truck series, this is the era where it's only eight trucks, right? Ooh, squeeze them! This is the era where it's only eight trucks, so if there's nine winners, then we actually need to be worried. And in a game like this, where just about anything can happen, nine different winners is definitely within the realm of possibility, so... Alright, cut off Chase Purdy. He's still in the fucking truck series. He keeps falling upwards into better equipment every single year and doing absolutely fuck all with it. I remember how I called that back in 2018. I remember the first race that I watched with Chase Purdy in it. I think it was Talladega. He was an absolute hazard the entire time. 
even a bigger hazard than Joe Graff, and I know that's saying something. I know that's saying something. All right, can we get to the inside? We cannot get to the inside. I think I went out. I, I pulled out too early. Pulled out too early. Corbin's pullout game is too strong, as it turns out. You know, the most fucked up thing about it is that all of the work that I did with... Could you not? Alright, looks like we're losing a bunch of spots on the white. All the work that I did with Corbin, all the did that I... All the work that I did, like, around surrounding his fucking, you know, career, I never actually talked to him one-on-one -on, -one on the phone. Only ever went through his sponsors. I didn't actually talk to him, like using voice. I mean, I texted him all the time. We communicated via, you know, that kind of communication, but I didn't actually, like, physically, like, verbally. Verbally is the word that I'm trying to find. Verbally communicate with him. Oh my god, we're gonna finish behind Chase Purdy too. Son of a bitch. Whatever, it's fine. It's race one of the season. There's plenty of time to recover. Plenty of time to recover. 101 speed rating. See, I did I did fast things. So, like... Yeah. <laughs> what is this camera angle, though? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yep. Yep. Yeah. That is an average Corbin Forrester at a plate track performance. <laughs> How do you get the fucking text off the screen? Can we, like... Remove the text? Oh boy. Yep. <laughs> it's a realistic blowover at least. <laughs> wow. What a time to be alive. Alright, well, so much for that. Okay, well, so, your winner of the Daytona Truck Race, Matt Crafton. <laughs> Wendell Shavis fourth. Good shit. Y'all remember Wendell Shavis? He should have won the 2018 Talladega truck race. Okay, we got 10 points. Perfect 10. Very good. All right, we got 10 points. That's a solid starting spot. 27th in the standings. That's how it's done right there. Beautiful. Let's head to the next race. Okay. Finish 27th. Let's head to Atlanta. It is hot Atlanta time. Now, I am going to... Turn on 3x wear, and yeah, we're going to keep everything else the way it is. I would like to save these changes. All right. And I'm also going to try and do two races per vid, so heading to Atlanta. We need to turn the season around. <laughs> we finished like five spots above last in the first race of the season. We need to uh, do something about that. Alright, so we've already got pre-put in setups. I'm gonna hope that these are good setups. I'm just gonna hope that 2018 me was capable of making a good setup. So let's just hope for the- So what I remember, what I recall from these games is that like the difference in like qualifying times is such that you're basically guaranteed to start like from 15th to 20th in every race. Because, like, the difference is, like, multiple tenths. And there's, like, a, not a whole lot more you can do. We got 14th. Hey, I'm already improving on those expectations. Yeah, look at the massive difference in these times. You got Harrison Burton 30th. Last place is a 33.8. First place is a 30.6. Hey, Brett! Brett out here making it happen. You'll love to see it. All right. I'm pretty happy with how the car feels. I don't actually know if I know... I don't know if I should be or not, but all I know is that it's all right. Yeah, look at that. Oh, that's a good-looking truck. That is all they have to say. That's also not how the truck even looks. I don't think I have the championship-winning truck anymore. I think I gave that away like a dumbass. I gave that shit away in, like, a Twitter giveaway. Okay, okay, good start, good start, good launch. Good launch. Let's keep going fast. Speed is indeed happening. Can I get to the inside without getting wrecked? Barely. Oh, self-clearing it. Self-clearing it. Oh, God, we have no speed. I can't self-clear against these guys, though. Otherwise, they will murder me. Hoo-wee, Piglet. All right. All right, here we go. Speed is happening. 
We are going fast at Atlanta. This is some good shit. I remember uh, ooh, the 2018 Atlanta race very fondly. Bush was just dominating it. And fucking, oh god, then he lost a tire in the pit lane. And then Corbin finished like 16th, like a chaff. Alright, we are getting attacked from all angles here. Ooh, this outside line is shit! Mike Snyder, you slow bitch! Okay, it's fine, it's fine, everything's fine. Alright, we're going fine, it's everything's great. Yes, actually, everything's fine. Okay, we're going, we're making it happen. Okay, can we please not stop in the center of the corner? Oh god, they're smoking. Smoking in the boys' room. Suddenly, this is just a motley crew heavy music episode, I guess. Okay, go Gillen, go faster, go Toyota teammate. Go Toyota teammate. Oh yes, here we go. Okay, now we're making it happen. Alright, we're back to making it happen. Okay. See, we had a rough start at Daytona. Ooh! But it's fine. It's fine. Daytona winner Matt Crafton's in front of me. Can I go to his outside without dying? No. I I, I feel like, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Actually, okay, it's fine. Everything's fine. Okay. Oh, dear. And just like that, wow, it is easy. It is easy for your momentum to swing in the exact opposite direction just with one wrong step. Like, for a moment, we were just flying. For a moment, we were flying, and then the next moment, we're dying. Okay, everything's fine. That's the end of the stage. Whew, okay. Breathe in, breathe out. Alright, where are we at? Are we pitting? Do we have pit stops? Okay, yes, we do have pit stops. Um, I'm gonna take half can, I'm gonna take no tires. Fuck it, I'm gonna go with no tires. I'm gonna take out a little bit more wedge. Just a wee bit more wedge. Alright, how's that look? We're That's what everyone else did in the field. Yeah. Pit road in this game, I remember being, like, a joke. I remember the uh, pit strategies being a joke. Okay. Maybe I should have, like, something on the upper left-hand side of the screen to indicate to me how many laps are left in the race. Ooh, ooh, we're trying to take them three wide! Ooh, we're trying to take them three wide! We're successfully taking them three wide! Oh, the speed is real! Is real! Oh, okay, I gotta keep squeezing Gilliland so I can stay in the draft. The draft is very important. Actually, you know what? I think the draft is really overblown in this game. But in the truck series, it at least makes sense. Because they're basically just giant bricks that are rolling around every track. And, like, every single every single track is basically, like, has the potential to be a Daytona Talladega type place. Alright. Ooh, he, 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 you son of a fucking bitch, Rhodes. Oh my god, he drove like a cunt back then, even. Can I bait him to the outside? I don't think I'm going to successfully bait him to the outside. Ooh. Okay, we're fine. Everything's fine. P6. P6. We're getting stage points. Got two stage points in the previous stage. That's some good shit. That's some good shit. Who the fuck is the leader? Okay, here we go. Go faster, bitch. I can't believe I'm really bump drafting roads right now. Really working with this motherfucker. Actually, I think we've hit our upper limit here. Because I'm not really making much forward progress. Oh, hang on. Haley's just giving me the line. Haley's giving me the line. What a Chad, dude. What an actual bro. Haley just laying over and letting me get the spot. I'm going to clean pass him just for that. Maybe there's only a rivals in career mode? I don't know. I swear there's there should be rivalries in this at this point, right? I never played NASCAR Heat 5, so I guess I have no idea. I have no idea. I don't think anything changed in Heat 5 versus Heat 4. That's the reason I didn't buy Heat 5, is because Corbin wasn't in it. No. No, the reason is because that was 2020, and I was completely disillusioned to racing. Well, not racing. I, I, I've always liked IndyCar. I mean, when I actually started caring about it. Like, 2015 to 2017, when I didn't know anything about it, I did not care. Alright, we've got plenty of fuel. We actually probably could have, like, not pit, and probably have saved enough under the cautions. Roman Green this lap. Okay, so it's Sauter versus Moffat in the lead. This is some good shit. This is some good shit. I'd pay to see this battle. Prime Johnny Sauter versus, uh, Hattori Brett Moffat. Oh, yeah. Mmm, that's tasty. Mmm, that's a tasty burger. Mmm, this is a tasty burger. 
but we're gonna go for it anyway. Second place! Second place, what a fucking battle! Oh god, Justin Haley! Justin Haley out of nowhere! What a fucking move! Holy shit! Oh, don't, don't wreck now. Not after all we've been through. Okay, it's fine, everything's fine. We're, we, we've got no fucking momentum. Okay, well, I thought I had made a great move. But this is actually now a more average Corbin Forrester performance going on. Okay. Brett's just leaving the inside open to Justin Haley. And there he goes. No, he doesn't. Brett, cut him off. Ooh, sorry, Johnny. Go faster, you son of a bitch. No. All right, Johnny is just getting in the way. Sorry, Ultimate 23 Dragon. That, that probably was my fault, but, like, uh, it's fine. Okay. Here we go. Okay, we're closing back in. All right. As it turns out, all I needed was clean air to be able to make this turn. Okay. Get my fucking finger. My thumb is just hovering over the square button at all times. Like, I need to change my fucking thumb position on this controller so that I don't fucking downshift on accident. All right. We are very slow in turn one. Because here comes Johnny. Here comes Jonathan. Oh... Uh... Boy, if we're only going to have, like, fifth place speed every week, that's going to make winning the championship very difficult. I mean, it's going to make making the chase pretty easy, but winning the championship is going to be uh, a lot more difficult. Boy, there is just a fucking four-car breakaway out in the front. This is the 1990 Daytona 500 that we're watching. Ugh. Come on, car, truck, whatever you want to call it. Do I want to move? Do I want to let Sauter go by and try and draft with him? We're not closing in. Oh, he's trying! <laughs> he tried to arrow loose me, the son of a bitch. The son of a bitch back there. <laughs> it's fine, everything's fine, we're fifth. Maybe we'll bump into the chase. I mean, I did finish 27th with no stage points in the previous race, so maybe, uh... Maybe making the chase is, uh, a little bit of an ambitious, uh, position. Okay. If I let Johnny go by, he's probably just gonna drive off. But, like, I don't have any other ideas. I think maybe we let him go into turn one and try to draft with him because we're only losing time to the leaders at this point. They're just perfectly tandem drafting with four trucks off into the fucking distance. Okay. Johnny, don't make me, don't make me regret this. Head on by, bud. Head on by. Using the outside lane in Atlanta, which is actually viable for, like, one lap. One lap. Then, then don't forget, this is a uh, 2018 Atlanta. This is a uh, good Atlanta. This is not a uh, fucking super speedway Atlanta. All right, Johnny. All right, Johnny. Let's go. White flag is out. Come on, Johnny. We can make it. We can make up the difference. We can do it. Or we can hit the fucking apron and die. That's also an option. All right, so something tells me I will not be finishing good in this race. Oh, dear, I've got to block everyone. Dalton Sargent's up here. What the fuck is that all about? Ugh. All right, beautiful. All right, P6. P6 is entirely acceptable. I am okay with this result. P6 is the position that we're going to finish. Sixth place. Speed rating was 103. Not bad. Man, these would be such great thumbnail opportunities if it weren't for the fucking ninth Kamikaze Game 78 floating up there. Can I, like, turn off the HUD, like, right, like, as I'm hitting the line, and then that would get rid of this? How do I get rid of this? Someone in the comments section, please give me an assist on that. Or maybe there's a frame right as we're coming to this. Right as we're coming to that, that makes it. They're like a single frame. A single frame that's able to uh, do that. There might be just a singular frame that would allow us to do that. Well, Brett wins at Atlanta, so at least that part of the universe is still intact. So, that guarantees his seat for the rest of the season. Hey, we're up to 15. Hey, but we're like 20 points behind, like 10th probably. So that's unfortunate. But it's fine. We got plenty of, plenty of time here. Plenty. Plenty of time. It's an entire season. It's just the first two races of the year. Uh, we got plenty of time to make up the difference and get into the chase. And I do believe that is going to do it for this episode. On to Las Vegas. Next time, in any case. Um, 
How do we look at other things? We have zero wins. Hell yeah. Uh, season standings is this button. Here we go. All right. So we are... 18 points out of the chase currently. No, 8th place. Okay, never mind. Um, 19 points out of the... Hello? 19 points out of the chase. It's very close between Fontaine and Gregson. Amazing. It's a pretty normal chase apart from that. So that's good. Um, there doesn't appear to be any other menus for us to look at in season mode. Why does it keep blinking? You don't see it, but it's blinking on my end. I don't know why it keeps blinking. All I know is that we're going to Vegas next time, so... This is going to be a new playthrough. Probably just a one season, even if I don't win the championship. This is just going to be a fun playthrough. Hope to see you in the next part. See you then. Bye! Come on! Die! What is it going to take? Someone die! Not me! And then that. Then, then just that. Stupid. Yeah, this is exactly what a tournament would be like. I was about to, I was about to get very mad. Never mind. I still get to be very mad. Uh, rubbing, grinding, banging, cuddling. Fuck it. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good one.